Hey guys, it's Monty. Um, this is the finger picking video, long promised, that has taken quite a t some time to get to you, so I apologize in advance. What I'm going to do is I'm going to show you two particular finger picking patterns that could be used pretty much on any of the songs that we do that are worship once the song slows down or if it's already slow. I'm going to use two songs as examples, uh, one that's a little bit more up-tempo and one that's a little more down-tempo. So we're going to look at You Are My King, and we're going to look at um, how great is our God. Let's start with You Are My King. Um, on this one, what I'm going to show you is a uh, pattern that is essentially, uh, by the way, the chords here are, I'm forgiven. Because, oh, that's a G, sorry. Because you were forsaken, A sus to A. D, I'm accepted, G. A, a sus to A, you are condemned, then D over F sharp. I'm alive and well, your spirit is within me, and then now it goes to a G. Because you, A sus, died and rose again, D sus, D, okay? <clears> of <throat> course, it's a little different, but we'll get there, and, and, and you guys probably already know it, so I'm not concerned about the chords as much as I am right now concerned about finger picking. Okay, so here's the main thing. The thumb is your bass note. Your other fingers are, are treble. <clears throat> so what we're going to do is do a picking pattern that starts, uh, that, that uses these three fingers right here to almost be uh, in unison plucking those three strings right there together. So you're going to sound like this. Hit the bass note, which in this case, in the chord of D, is a D, and then the three beneath it. Okay, so you're gonna go. I'm forgiven. Uh, there we go. I'm forgiven because you were forsaken. I'm accepted. You were condemned. Your spirit is within me because you died and rose again. Okay, so here's the deal. Um, that's just the chords I showed you with this picking pattern. And the thing that I'm doing here is I'm going bass, then the first note of the treble underneath it, and then all three of those together. So you got... And what you'll find is as you do this um, thing, your chord is right beneath you. So a D chord has the three notes of the chord right beneath it. And A, you're hitting the five there, the five string, and then hitting the three chord, uh, the, the A chord beneath it, or the sus. Although it's not wrong to do that if you want to vary it up, but you want to hit those middle strings on the A. And then the G, you're going to hit the G as the bass note. And then you're probably going to go for the bottom of three, or depending on what sound you're looking for, um, the middle strings or the, the bottom three. Okay? So here we go. Thumb, first finger together. I'm forgiven, thumb. First finger again there on the um, G string. Because A, you were forsaken. I'm accepted. You were condemned. I'm alive and well. Your spirit is within me. Because, sorry, wrong chord, you died and rose again. Okay, so you get the very basic idea, and that is the first strumming pattern. Really what it comes down to is thumb, first finger, three fingers together. And you can just practice it like that on one chord to get used to it. And then maybe go to a different chord, G. And try it on an 
A. Maybe play around with that A sus. All right, you get the idea there? Now that's the first strumming pattern, and that will be, so let's say, you're going to try and play that along with um, You Are My Candy.